Let me check it out. Got this little knife here. It says Japan on it. Anyways, man, this uh, this yard is Cadillac Central, man. There must be like five of these old Cadillacs in here. I say old, but you know, more or less around this time, I guess. There's one. Uh, this one's a little older. But uh, I'll start with this one. 1984 Cadillac Fleetwood Brougham. Came out of Abilene, Abilene, Texas. This is rough. John Spear, I like the Derek. I like to get that. Uh, of course, I'm a Houston Oilers fan, so that always reminds me of the Oilers. Back bumper ain't bad. These pieces here, the tail lights. The beasles. <laughs> the extensions here aren't, aren't in rough shape. Obviously, that, that broke off probably a long time ago. How's that? Uh, I think there's a dent right there. Other than that, deck lid looks okay. This side, eh, she's got some dents on her. She got good trim. Oh, she was a, a vinyl top car. Dan, Dan, I think that might have been the yard. Windshield's busted. It's got a crack on it. Fender, it's rough. Header panel, it's got some issues. Bumper, I guess it took a hit right in this area. Boom. Good, don't look bad. I cut this off. A little flopping on that grill. The hood's in nice shape though. I don't see a dent on it. Trim pieces are good too. I wonder if was this the uh, <laughs> the emblem there? The ornament I mean. Let's get that bin before I forget it. Oh no, god dang it, freaking door. Ugh. That door, I closed it and now she don't want to open. Yeah, interior's rough. This car's been here two days, I think. I want to say a day or two, not too long. But... Crap, damn thing's broken too, so I can't open it. Yeah, get bitch to open. What are we reading, 46,000? Up there it says, yeah, the next oil change would have been 05 16 of 2024 <laughs> yeah I don't know if that uh, should be 146,000 steering wheel's gone column looks good though but this is a uh, telescope and com uh, column I thought about it but man I, I took one of those a while back man it took months to sell that thing Everybody was offering me freaking, uh, you know, it was lowballing me on it. I don't even think I made a hundred bucks on it. Here, let's get that, let's get that uh, RPO code. These first year of the RPO codes. This will make the Google man happy. <laughs> All right. I think I saw the trailer. They decided to go the route of a uh, third gen F bodies. They figured like, yeah, we don't really feel like dropping the uh, the tank. We'll just go. We we'll just cut a hole in the uh, <laughs> in the trunk. This is new. Looks a little bitched up though. Hmm. 
wonder what the deal was. I mean, they didn't put the new one in. They cut it out. They were going to change it. Is that what they were going to do? Well, no, no. Actually, it was in there. They changed it out for another one. About this what? I don't know. That's weird. Like, that's what they changed it out of. Or they changed it to. That looks... I don't know. Hmm. Anyways, she's rocking a teeny weeny sway bar with the 7.5. Strippers love my pole. <laughs> Interesting. Ooh, lavender face soap. All right. Let's take a quick look under the hood. Easy look under, man. Oh, that rain's coming. Oh, man. Ugh. 4.1 liter. 84. Looks like they put a new master cylinder. A new heater valve. Some wires. Maybe some plugs. Well, I guess that'll uh, pretty much do it. Let me just take a quick look under the. Uh, see that. Uh, I was wondering if it was gonna be like milk chocolate or something. Oh no, crap! That was set down here. It'll take forever. Anyways, I guess that'll do it, people. Quick one on this one. You know, I don't think there's anything else to, to show. Oh, I'm gonna forget my, my knife there. All right, people. On to the next one.